Now, higher rent prices could also put an end to Austin's creative community. Not only are the local artists and musicians having a tough time affording just living here, even the venues where they perform and do their work find it difficult to keep pace with the rising rent and property taxes. But now the city of Austin wants to help with that. Candy Rodriguez is in East Austin this morning to tell us how exactly they plan on doing that. Good morning. Hey John, good morning. We'll take a look behind me here. This is the Austin School of Film and you can check out the building. It is a little dark this morning, but I'm telling you, it is not a small building. So you can only imagine how much this land is worth here in East Austin off of Tillery Street near Airport Boulevard. Those here say the goal is to provide low cost working space for artists. This is one of the many reasons the city's economic development department, along with Austin Music, want to help places like this one stay in business or help those who have been previously displaced. They're doing it through a program called the Creative Space Assistant Program. After the city identified affordable space for artists and musicians as a priority area of concern, the program has $750,000 from the city's general fund. They're asking both artist-focused nonprofits like this one, as well as qualifying for profit live music venues, performance spaces, and art galleries to apply. The arts and music community are, uh, bring a vibrancy to Austin and make it unique. Um, and, um, you know, this program is a response to uh, the dramatic growth that we've seen in Austin over the past decade, the increasing rents going higher and higher. Kim adds that it's all about preserving the arts in the community here in the city. Those who qualify could get up to a $50,000 grant. And she also tells me that this money can be used to pay rent or it can also be used to pay improvements that you want to make in the facility itself. Now take a look at your screen. This is the first informational meeting they will have today at City Hall at 2. There's the information. Deadline to submit eligibility requirements is next Friday. Those selected will be notified by this May and understand the priority will be given to organizations facing immediate and critical needs. Guys, back to you. Thank you very much. This is not the first time the city's done this, though. Last year, the Art Space Assistance Pilot Program provided grants for artists. It was funded with $200,000 from the Music Venue Assistance Program. The money was used to help organizations, including Austin School of Film, Latinitas, and Tapestry Dance Companies, as well as several others. All right.